so now we are going to solve some problems related to blood relationship this is another kind of problem where you don't need any formula or anything that's why we haven't discussed any formula but simply simple iq and your own blood relationship calculations might help you to solve this one as well remember one thing <clears throat> although we haven't discussed any formula but there are something that need to be told that need to be uh, discussed and that idea simply is that uh, this is you this is your brother your cousin your wife all in the same generation one generation above will be your father your mother your uncle your aunt everyone two generation father grandfather grandmother are there one generation below you have your son daughter nephew niece all this okay the granddaughter grandson and all so this is a hierarchy if you remember this hierarchy then you will be able to answer most of these questions and always make sure that not only this hierarchy but also you need to put yourself in terms of analyzing the blood relationship that is asked in the question all right so in this case how i related to sangeeta so let's assume that sangeeta's daughter is my daughter's mother sangeeta's daughter this is sangeeta's daughter Sangeeta's daughter is my daughter's mother. Okay, this is me, and this is our daughter, and Sangeeta's daughter is the mother of my daughter. So basically, Sangeeta's daughter is my wife, isn't it? So if Sangeeta's daughter is my wife, then how am I related to Sangeeta? I am son-in-law if I am male. If I am son-in-law, if I am male. otherwise otherwise if i am female then of course i am daughter of sangeeta otherwise there is no other option so option d should be the correct answer in this case got it quite easy because basically sangeeta's daughter is my wife that's how the relationship comes in now move to the second question if a is a brother of b so a and b belong to same lineage and a is male so male with boxes female with circle that's what we use b is the sister of c b is a sister of c c is the father of d c is male father of d how d is related to a so look at it a b c all belong to same generation same generation so d is and a they are related one generation above so basically how d is related to a means d is nephew d if male nephew if female niece nephew or niece isn't it this is the idea this can be the idea otherwise but the thing is in this question if you look at this question they haven't clearly stated whether it's male or female so male nephew otherwise niece okay because a b a c following to same generations there so either you can say nephew or niece but properly to be proper because in this case we know that c d has a direct relation to, to c okay because a is brother of b b is sister of c okay c is father of d so basically nephew or niece yes you can say that that is the correct answer now let's move to another problem here and here let's take a different color deepak said to nitin that boy playing with the football is younger of the two brothers of the daughter of my father's wife okay that's a too much information to process the the boy so we're talking about a boy male playing with football is younger of the two brothers younger of the two brothers two brothers okay of the daughter so let's put the boy in the center here two brothers we are looking two brothers we are looking here two brothers younger that means one generation later younger of the two brothers of the daughter brothers this brothers of the daughter means this is the daughter okay of daughter of my father's wife my father's wife my my mother and my mother's daughter means this is where me should be placed 
So basically, my relationship with my mother's daughter is my mother's daughter is my sister. Okay. How is the boy playing football related to Deepak? Me in this case is Deepak. So Deepak is male. How is the boy related to me? Okay, that boy playing the football is younger of the two brothers. So basically, not one generation below. Basically, this is another brother. So basically, the boy is younger brother. Younger brother. So boy is basically the younger brother. So in this case, no younger or older. Only says brother. So we can say yeah, B is the brother of mine, brother of Deepak. Okay. So B is not in one generation below what I said earlier. Basically, it says that the the boy playing with the football is younger of the two brothers. So this is younger than these two brothers. That doesn't mean the B is uh, in the next generation, of course. So B is younger brother than them, and my mother's daughter is my sister, and B is a brother of my sister. So the B is brother of me as well. Got it? So don't get confused. This question will kill your time in CS and NET exam. That's why I told. So only answer the question which will save time and not kill it. Pointing to a person, Deepak said, "His only brother." See again the same type of question. This kind of quote unquote question gets more difficult. Pointing towards a person, Deepak said, "His only brother is the father of my daughter's father. My daughter, this is me. My daughter in the next generation, this is me. My daughter's father means me." his only brother so my only brother so basically we are introducing my only brother to the person okay so how is the person is related to deepak so if me means deepak here so this is only brother means what so the uh, the person the deepak is introducing is basically uncle of the uncle of whom the daughter means my daughter uncle of my daughter so the relationship is uncle remember two things this is you and this is your father if they ask you how you are related to your father the answer is son how your father is related to you father remember that this is very important from which perspective we are finding the relationship otherwise the total answer will be wrong so in this case Deepak said his only brother is the father of my daughter's father. So basically, how is the person related to De Deepak? Uncle. His only brother. This is this is the person Deepak is referring. His only brother. Okay, is the father of my daughter's father. this is my daughter's father so this is this is me means my father and this is the person deepak introducing deepak is stating here deepak is stating here this is deepak's father and this is the person deepak is introducing so basically deepak is one generation below than this person so deepak and person how the person is related to deepak uncle how deepak is related to the person nephew got it this is how it works remember that always because if you draw it correctly you will answer it one go if you rethink it two three times then this problem will be really complicated in your mind so the best deal for this problems blood relation particularly is to solve it one go okay otherwise if you can solve it in one go then it will be a big problem for you fine <clears throat> that's how we'll solve them no such formula no such complication simple issues and you can solve them 